Ladies and gentlemen, it is officially the one year anniversary of the One Piece TCG channel, DK's Card Pirates. So I wanted to say a huge thank you and a huge shout out to all the beautiful people at home who like, commented, and supported the channel from the first day and who are continually coming in. So I want to say a huge shout out to y'all. You're absolutely amazing and I would not be doing any of this stuff without y'all. But to kick everything off, ladies and gentlemen, um, it's funny. Drip and I are chose to give away. Remember that Odin alt art leader that I pulled last like two days ago, three days ago, we're going to be giving this away. <laughs> All you have to do, like, comment, subscribe, and click the link down below and enter into the giveaway on the link. There's only 47 hours, zero entries right now at the time of recording, and someone's going to win this card literally for free. We are rich. Let's get it going. Welcome back to the channel, gentlemen. Hopefully, y'all are having an absolutely wonderful, beautiful, and an amazing day. Now, before we get started, um, once again, I, I do want to reiterate, we are going to be giving away this Olden Alt Art Leader card on Drip. Just click the link down below and enter the giveaway. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, this Saturday, do not forget, this Saturday, the 13th at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, I am going to be going live with Drip, and we're giving away OPO5 booster packs, OPO7 booster packs, and we're going to be doing $1 auctions for all darts packs all throughout the night. So make sure to join both links in the description below. But to kind of commemorate this one-year anniversary for myself, I thought, what should I do to celebrate with y'all obviously the drip stuff the giveaways is all gonna be fun it's all happening this weekend which happens to be the week the anniversary here i went into my sealed personal collection and i found this og op02 booster box from first print you can't really tell first print second print because they're all kind of same but i got this box literally the day op02 released last year this box at the time of recording i got it from an lcs who was scalping the living bejesus out of it that's when opio was one piece was like really hyped up this box at the time was like 220. then of course boxes went up high and now opio 2 boxes are low but this was in my sealed collection so i have a couple so i was like you know what to celebrate let's see if one of my sealed booster boxes can finally get me a manga rare <laughs> so honestly dude this has been sitting in my closet for almost a year whatever opio 2 released and now it's about to be ripped open with you beautiful people at home we're risking it for the biscuit ladies and gentlemen what did he say we're pulling something insane this has been sitting in the closet for over a year there's a guarantee this is gonna have heat pretty please <laughs> let's get it going two hours later here we are an opio 2 i never i don't think they ever changed it but if you kind of give an example of like a now modern booster box the modern booster boxes are like wider than the original booster box in opio 1 opio 2 they had like literally like a square but the new ones are kind of wider so um i think that they haven't changed the opio 2's booster boxes but oh yeah i forgot they do have a revision pack when they had like changes to the cards and of course a box promotion pack but i think the revision pack is just like alterations to current cards with new wording so like yeah this is just cards with new wording guard point um star deck three i think they just had to like reword the cards for the leaders i don't remember it having a croc alt art leader though so that's interesting so let's start with the box for motion pack ladies and gentlemen and see what this bad boy can hold inside okay let's go it's a slash type character and green i don't think i've pulled this before Yes, I have. Yes, I have. I have, in fact, pulled this piece of crap before several times, and he is the biggest piece of crap in the history of the One Piece TCG and the One Piece anime and in anime and in human history. Trash! Well, ladies and gentlemen, as they say, as they say, we risk it for the biscuit. Let's get it going! Let's get it going! First pack magic, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be a big one. This is going to be a big one. Come on. Big boy pulls only. Big boy pulls only up in here, ladies and gentlemen. I remember they have black now, and black, and so I have to add another pile when I'm opening. Last time I opened something was literally OPO1, so they only had blue cards. No, like the original four, but then I think they incorporated black into the set. Okay, so we have a carrot and A Luffy SR, which is not bad. Luffy SR is okay. And of course, we get a really good Dawn. So that's not too bad, ladies and gentlemen. Good way to start. 
good way to start and it's gonna start even better it's gonna be even better bro because right now it's just the start of everything that's special here and hopefully y'all are having a wonderful day and once again i cannot reiterate enough thank y'all so much for the constant love support you guys are absolutely amazing um and this is a dead pack because of the leader <laughs> but okay not too bad it's fine it's fine we take what we can we take what we can but honestly like i was told previously so huge shout out to the family i think it was the yang family that was on the comments here like isn't it your one year anniversary i'm like it, it technically is it actually is so i was like bro this is crazy man i cannot believe i've been degening one piece packs for a year Damn! That is absolutely insane. I, I can't even imagine, man. Smoker and an alt art, ladies and gentlemen. Alt art already. It's not a manga, so <laughs> it's kind of like, God. It's okay. What can it be? It's just hiding in my closet for a year. You know what? That's not bad, bro. <laughs> that's not That's not bad. Kuzan alt art from OPO2. I've never, ever pulled this card, and that is a solid, solid alt art hit. We take that because it's actually a really nice alt art. I don't know what the value of it is now, but it's a pretty good card. Pretty solid card. We take that. Can we pull something even better in our next alt art hit? That's what the goal is, okay? That is what the goal is, and that's what's going to happen. Watch this. Pisa Dookie Sauce Squardo. Here we go. Ice Age, which should be banned in my opinion. That's, I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. It's not going to be bad. Sengoku and Marco Blocker. I remember back in the day, Marco Blocker was so broken. They had to ban him to using only one per deck. So that's uh, the good old days. When Whitebeard was just dominant. <laughs> that was just when Whitebeard was the best deck in the world. The good old days. Now he's not even close. But that's okay. I mean, he's still good. He's still okay. He's still okay. He's not bad. He's fine. But here we go, Don Quixote. No, that's not. That's Mihawk. What am I doing? Here we go, Shishilian. Let's go, Daifugo, Makino. I wonder if Makino actually has any value right now. And Ace, seven cost Ace SR, bro. So, you know how nice it would be to pull a manga rare finally on our one year anniversary. It'd be so nice, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be just the nicest thing? It'd just be so nice. Come on. Come on, dude. It'll be super nice. It'd be the greatest thing in the history of the world. Darn it. One Piece TCG. Come on. But a Kuzan Altar is not bad. It's a really good way to start. I think that, that Kuzan Altar is still... The Kuzan that 4 cost 5,000 power, I think it's still pretty playable. I don't know if he's, like, widely played, but he's still good. And nothing so far, ladies and gentlemen. Nothing so far... Douglas Bullet, Hina, and a Nami SR. This Nami was expensive earlier. I don't think it's expensive anymore, but it's a really good card. That Nami SR is actually very, very important as well um, for film Doffy back in the day. So I don't know if it's still good. I think Uta still plays it a lot, but I don't know how like playable, playable it is. Um, so here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Still blazing through. Saul, great character. Django, Morley. Robin, film type, crap, Sea Quake, and Luffy blocker. So still nothing too insane, ladies and gentlemen. Nothing too insane, other than the Kuzan alt art. I'm hoping maybe this, since it's been in my closet for a year, you know what I mean, that we pull like, 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 you know, give me an alt art leader. That'd be good. I would take an alt art leader any day. Alt art leader any day of the week let's get it going ladies and gentlemen ice age again whitey bay minnow koala i can't I'm, I'm losing my my mojo here and magellan not bad magellan's not bad bro magellan's good magellan's solid magellan is very very solid here we go final pack just kidding there's still so much more to go so we're gonna blaze through as much as we can but let's come just just give me some good man I think, okay, so in my last OPO one box that I opened, ladies and gentlemen, the one we're giving away, the uh, Olden Alt Art Leader, uh, we only got two hits from that box. I don't know if that's going to be the same case for this box, but this is literally an OG box. So, like I said before, I don't think there's any way you can tell it's an OG box, other than if you bought it a year ago, you kept it in storage, and now you're opening it a year later, like an idiot. But, like I said before, this is hopefully going to be worth the opening, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Come on. 
this is good this here we go shanks dawn alt art that's not bad box hit that's good that's solid very solid hit very very solid solid hit now here we go ladies and gentlemen this is box the final pack on the right side here we go big boy pulls only big boy pulls only let's get it going i'm excited for the drip stream this oh okay that's not going to be a big boy pull but it is a big boy leader back in the day anyway i'm just hoping like honestly that we just pull like a solid solid hit that's just like a solid solid hit like a nice alt art with value not just a piece of dookie sauce come on let's go ladies and gentlemen come on daifugo again mr one Masked douche, and we got a hit, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, that's not bad, bro. That's not bad. That's 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 really good. Like, that's really good. Like, this is this is good. This is. <laughs> I mean, this is... This is really good. <laughs> I mean, that's good, bro. That's really good. Like, that Borsalino alt art is super solid. That's a very, very good card. Like, if I was to say, like, yo, this is the card that you should pull back in the day. I don't know what the Borsalino alt art value is anymore. But I know he's still playable for a fact. He's a very, very good card. Um, like I said, Kuzan SR as well. Like, there's a lot of good cards in OPO2 for Navy back in the day anyway. Um, that Borsalino blocker, I don't know if his value is, like, skyrocketed downwards, but he used to be almost a $100 card. Now, I don't know. I just don't know. I'm hoping he still has some value, though. But we did pull two altars, ladies and gentlemen, so there's still hope. There's still hope because, um, my Discord and the community here was like, Yo, DK, there's three hit boxes." for sure i'm like really in old sets fine i'll believe you i choose to believe you because it's what delusion is <laughs> let's get it going come on it's gonna be good it's gonna be really good let's do this come on smoker and masked douche again he just comes up in our dreams and never goes away we're blazing through we're gonna get a three hit box ladies and gentlemen i believe it come on come on three hit booster box three hit booster box all up in here. All up in here. Let's go. Come on. Red. Helmepo. Yamato. And... It is worthless. Wor I'm, just, I'm not even going to lie to you. Worthless. But that's fine. We still have several packs to go, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be the first three-hit booster. I don't know if it's the first. I'm not even going to lie to you. I, people said there are three-hit booster boxes. I just don't remember that for OPO2. But, like I said before, that's why we do this. Trash. And trash. <laughs> it's trash. <laughs> oh, five packs to go. Six packs to go. Five packs to go. Five packs to go, ladies and gentlemen. Five packs to go. Come on. Come on. Oh, here we are. Come on. Here we are. Let's do this. Let's do this. Five packs to go. I still have the faith. I still have the faith. You still must have faith. Or else. You know what? Not bad. Three hit booster box. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> okay. That's not bad, dude. This is actually... Okay, real talk, though. Real talk, though. This is a... This is a good booster box, bro. This is a good booster box. This is, this is a really good booster box. Like, this is... Like, jokes aside, man. We got a Navy alt art. Two Navy alt arts. Kuzan and Borsalino, which is quite arguably the most playable alt art. And the pl most playable card from OPO2, in my opinion. And um, Kuzan's alt art. So both still very, very playable. Good cards. And we pulled the worthless Uta film card. So, <laughs> it's, I mean, well, that's three hits, bro. That's the secret rare. And that's two alt arts in one booster box. So I think the rest of these cards are trash now. But, I mean, that that olden card looks really cool. I remember that card from back in the day. But I think the rest of these cards are probably duds. Realistically speaking, ladies and gentlemen, I think that we did really good. We pulled the Uta secret rare. Um, what does this card even do? Dawn minus two. You may turn the special number down. Card. Let me reveal you that there. Hmm. B 
bro, that's not bad. I'm thinking, can I play RP Luffy with you? I don't think it's worth it, though. It's like... Yeah, nah, it's not, you could, but like, I don't think this is worth having. Because then you'd rather just play 7 cost Kid, in all honesty. But, I mean, 8... Yeah, I don't know, dude. This He's okay. I think Uta's okay. We got the Kuzan SR, Kuzan Alt Art, okay? And then, like I said, the big hit, the Borsalino Alt Art from OPO2, ladies and gentlemen. So, and Nami SR. So, in all honesty... Real talk, no saltiness aside. I know we didn't pull a manga rare, but like third best case scenario <laughs> right here. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank y'all so much for constant love support and for always for the channel. Um, I really, really do appreciate you. Your comments do not go unnoticed. I try to respond to as many as I can on a pretty consistent basis. Um, but once again, if you did enjoy the video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And of course, if you did want to enter the giveaway for this Kozuki Olden Alt Art Leader card, just click the link down in the description below. And of course, remember to RSVP to the drip stream this Saturday at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time because we're going to give away a lot of stuff. But I want to say thank you all so much for the constant level support. Have a great rest of y'all's week, and I will see you on Saturday. It's what you do You give me yellow eyes Orange skies Red, see your eyes